guys, what's up and welcome back. Today we are going to take a look at some new Season 1 2024 leaks as well as some info on some free content and more. So definitely make sure to watch the full video and with that being said, here we go. Okay, so in yesterday's video, we took a look at these four characters and guns over here, being this red riding hood inspired character with the legendary LW3 Tundra being the new gun, this wolf character as well with this legendary AS Valskin, this creepy Alice in the Wonderland character holding what looks to be a BPS36 skin, and this final character over here holding what looks to be a QQ9 skin. Now I'm pretty sure both of those are going to be in the BP, but of course let's wait and see. Also as you guys can see, it seems like we are going to have a somewhat dark, spooky fairy tale sort of theme for season 1. Now today a new teaser has come out revealing not only the translated name of the new season being Dark Mystery, but also the release date, which seems to be the 5th of January. Note, this date is for the CN version, which is expected to receive the update before Global, but expect Global to also receive the update somewhere around there. Now besides the name and the date, we can also see a new character in this teaser, which kinda gives off some Cinderella sort of vibes, and she seems to be holding a legendary PDW blueprint. Now also to her left, we can see that same Alice in the Wonderland sort of character, but this time she is holding a different blueprint. So currently I am unsure if she is going to be a BP character or a Lucky Draw character. Yesterday I thought she is potentially going to be a Battle Pass character because of the blueprint she was holding, but now because of this new teaser, I'm just not sure. I hope she is though, anything is possible, so let's wait and see. But yeah, that is some new info regarding Season 1 Dark Mystery, which is expected to release on the 5th of January for China, and yeah, expect a lot of leaks to drop over the next couple of days. Anyways, though, the update reserve rewards are out for Global, which indicates that Global should be receiving the update soon as well, and this includes two gold credit coupons, a rank shield card, two epic credit crates, and a calling card as well. And also, when you click reserve, it says login on the 7th to claim your rewards. So it looks like Global should be receiving the update on the 7th of January, so just a few days after the CN version. Anyways though, in other news, yesterday you were able to unlock Alex Mason Piercing Frost through the holiday countdown event by playing one game in the Winter in Summer playlist. It is a cool winter inspired version of his base outfit, so if you weren't around when he originally released a few years ago, then this is perfect. However, if you didn't claim him yesterday, then you sadly can't unlock him anymore. But yeah, overall, it's a solid reward. Moving on some more though, here is a showcase of all the rewards in the Mythic Siren Lucky Draw, well except for Siren herself. Also note, this show should be releasing this Friday, which is the 5th of January. Check it out.
yeah, that is the draw, and it's kind of crazy to think that this draw is releasing in less than three days. However, we still don't have a proper look at her. But yeah, here's a hollow watch, which I've got to say is actually really cool with that jellyfish spinning a sort of design. Also, I do want to say that this new melee skin coming in this draw falls in the base category and it's a dual wielded razor blade that does have a special inspect animation. To be honest, I am mainly going after the melee weapon and the BK as well. And yeah, if I'm gonna be honest, I don't really care too much about Mythic Siren herself. But yeah guys, definitely give me your thoughts about Siren and just the whole draw in general. But yeah, at the same time, with that being said though guys, that is going to be all for today's pretty short season 1 video, with a tad bit of season 11 content as well. So, I hope you guys did enjoy, and if you did, please make sure to drop a like and a sub as well, it is greatly appreciated. So, thank you for watching, have a great day, and for now, well, squally out, and cheers, catch you in the next one, and for now, bye! Thank you.